Hello and welcome back to your Energy Booster Podcast. I am so happy to spend this little time with you in this episode that we are recording today. In the previous episode, we talk about our identity, our real identity in Christ. I guided you and introduced you to your true self and I hope it all made sense. In this episode, we will be talking about self-worth. Yes, you are right. We'll be talking about your self-worth. Well, let me just share a little bit of my experience in the past. Yeah, in the past, I would always base my worth into numbers. Like, how did I perform in certain role that I had in my life? Or I'm still having it right now. Like, you know, as a mom, as a friend, as a sister, daughter, co-worker, nurse, entrepreneur, and the list goes on. Have you ever felt like that too? I think we all did. And, you know, sometimes we still do. That we base our worth into our job and what we do and how we do it. Did you do great? Did we do good? Did we do poor or poorly? And, you know, if we base our worth on that, on those numbers and, you know, how we evaluate ourselves and how we do on certain roles in our life, we could fail, right? And so when we fail, we felt like, you know, we suck too. And we felt like we'll never be enough. And we'll never be good enough. But when we have success, of course we do too. We feel good. Feel so good. And so it's like a roller coaster ride at the same time. And, you know, sometimes it will let us to just be so hard on ourselves because we keep on pushing. We are the ones pressuring ourselves and making ourselves burn out and get tired. Because we just want to, you know, we just wanted to achieve excellence if possible at all times so we can please other people around us and they would they would give us that validation that we are doing a great job we always wanted to hear that great job thingy some validation right well of course yeah we are human and that is normal we do or we did act like that well knowing your worth or our worth has nothing to do with anything external just a reminder knowing your worth is very personal it is your internal measure of how you see or value yourself regardless of what other people might think of you or say to you so indeed it is really knowing yourself so deep that regardless of what other people say we know our value but as a Christian I believe deeply believe that we are valuable enough because of who we are Genesis 1 26 says You are made in God's image, according to His likeness. A long time ago, even before God created us, before He created this universe, we were already the focus of His love. And here are some verses that would also remind us of how valuable or worthy we are. Isaiah 43, 4 says, You are precious in my eyes, and 
honored and I love you. Sam 46.5 says, God is within her. She will not fail. John 15.9 says, As the Father has loved me, so I have loved you. Abide in my love. Can you feel that? Those are beautiful verses to lean into. When we feel like, you know, we are useless and unworthy and never enough, we can just go through this Bible verses just to be reminded of, of our real worth in Christ. And yes, regardless of how the world sees you and tells you, let me just remind you that you are worthy. You are valuable. You are admirable. You are precious and worthwhile. Another verse says, The Lord will fight for you. You only need to be still. Exodus 14, 14. So stop questioning your worth. It is never based on the external world, but on the spiritual realms. Jesus died for us so he can have a relationship with us. And that, my friend, is more than enough to hold on to for us to be reminded every day and for us to know deep in our heart that we are worthy. So fight for your dreams. Go for that beautiful future that God has planted in your heart because you are worthy to live a wonderful life. Thank you.